Hey guys, what's up? It's Emma Cuber, and today I have a quick video of my meetings and goals on Bulldog Cubing 2017. This is a competition in Oaklawn, Oaklawn, Illinois, and it is being held. <laughs> Sorry, I have to look at the screen and everything. It is being held September 9th, 2017. So I know I'm making this video two months early, and this is probably like the first person to make it. But, yeah, there are, like, eight events, I think, and I'm going to be competing in six of them. I'll be competing in all of them except for the blind events. So, yeah, here we go. So, for 2x2, two two, I will be using the MF2S 2x2. Two two. I set this up, and now it is my main. I just really, really like it. I can spam TPS. doesn't really lock up. Really hard to lock up and everything. And it's just really good. I think I might have one of the best 2x2s. Two or not the best 2x2s. Two that best them of 2s or something. And so for 2x2, two two, all I really want to do is not fail. But if I were to actually say a goal, I would say like sub 3 average, sub sub like 1.9 1 1 single since I got a 1.95 at the last comp. And I'm going to see if I can get a 1.5. Um, sub 1.9. So yeah, here we go. I mean, <laughs> why did I say yeah, here we go? <laughs> Alright, so moving on to 3x3, I will be using the GTS 2. I will also be using this for OH, since I don't have any other good cubes. I tried to use the Send 1 Mars and set up that. That didn't work out. Um, I tried setting up the, um, the Waylong GTS V1. That still did not work out, so I'm just going to be using this cube for OH. But if not, I might just borrow my friend's Vulk because at the last comp, Hill Chris Cubing, my friend Simon um, let me use his Vulk for OH. And I got a 21 single on like a 25 average, so that's cool. And I think he's going to this one, so yeah, he'll probably use his. But anyways, just for 3x3 in general... I really, 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 really want a sub 10 single, mainly just because I got a 10.33 at the last comp, and I just really, really want to beat that, so like sub 10.1, sub 10, and also don't fail the average, because like at, at Hillcrest Cubing, even though I had a counting 10 in my average, um, I still got like a 13.23 average, which is my overall best in comp, but I wanted like a sub 13, sub 12.5. And then the next round I got a 14 average, which then didn't let me go to round, which then didn't let me go to finals, so that sucks. So yeah, let's hope I just don't fail my average on this. And also for OH, I'll probably do, I don't really know what to say, like, sub... 21 single or something i'll probably practice oh a lot more because i have a 20.60 single and i still haven't beaten that i really really want a sub 20 but i still can't get it so i'm gonna practice oh a lot today and like sub 24 average maybe sub 23 because i want to probably better be the by then i don't know why but there is no 4x4 four four, but there is 5x5 five five. so for 5x5 five five, like I don't really know what to say because I'm not that good at big cubes. Like, sub 155 single and, like, sub 205 average. I don't really know at all. I'm really bad at big cubes like that. Next, we have the most nub event ever, Pyraminx. I'm trying to get into this more, but um, I'm still really, really bad with L4E. But anyways, um, I really want to beat my 3.71 and maybe like get a sub 3 or something. And like sub 4, no not sub 4, sub 4.5 average or something like that. I don't know, I just really really want to beat my old single. And the last event which is Squan. Um, I'm actually really starting to get into this event ever since I got the X-Man Volt. And so, for Squan, I just want... Like, sub, hopefully, if I keep practicing, hopefully I can get sub 15 single. And, like, sub, I don't know, like, maybe if I keep trying, sub 20 average, maybe. 
So yeah, that's basically my mains and goals for Bulldog Cubing 2017. And yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. And I'll see you guys there. If you see me, say hi. And yes, I will be making a montage video, not a vlog.